Always a good time. 538 on your Tuesday. Here's Brian. Yeah, temperatures yesterday did get warm over a good chunk of the area. We had 90 in Burlington, Danville, Martinsville, Lexington, Ashboro yesterday, 91 in Winston-Salem. Cooled by a little bit of rain at PTI Airport, ending our dry streak at nine consecutive days without measurable rain. I uh, got about 13 one hundredths of, uh, of an inch of rain in the bucket yesterday. Uh, temperatures close to average. The morning low yesterday was 70. Because of the added moisture in the air today, it has not cooled much at all. We are certainly sitting at 76 currently at PTI Airport. Airport 78 in Winston Salem uh, and even some upper 60s in the mountains that were 10 degrees cooler yesterday. Very high humidity across the south and the moisture in the air is fuel for storms. If you have a trigger and we certainly do the storm system kind of inching more eastward than southward will eventually uh, bring some showers and storms into our area. Uh, some could get a little rough, especially by this evening morning. We've got some rough storms, heavy lightning moving into West Virginia from Ohio and Kentucky. And you can see how unsettled it is over much of Virginia. These initial storms should stay north of us, but will increase the action a bit later in the day today. High of 93 in the Piedmont Triad. Breezy too, with southwest winds at 10 to 20. High heat and humidity today, making it feel more like 100 degrees this afternoon with a high of 93. We stay warm in the evening till the rains come in and start to cool things down. Still a 40% chance for showers and storms. They will be scattered. We are expecting perhaps a line to develop sometime mid evening. That should be the last of it coming through the area, tapering off by around 11, maybe 12 o'clock tonight. 91 in the foothills. Best rain chances will be a bit earlier coming in out of the north and west with southwest winds at 5 to 10 and across the mountains. A hot high of 85 for the high country, staying warm and a good chance for showers and storms a late day into the evening. A hourly representation of how this plays out. I do think we have a chance for a shower storm around lunchtime. Temperatures at that point will be in the upper 80s and in, in the triad with um, heat index or heat indices getting into the low to mid 90s even at that point. Again, temperatures warming up around 93, 94 degrees today and there's that line I'm talking about coming through this evening pretty quickly and then should begin to taper off around late news time uh, a bit later on tonight. We reset things, bring more rain about your tomor tomorrow's forecast. The severe threat is measurably lower for Wednesday uh, than it will be today. Today's primary risk is uh, damaging winds, but we could see some heavy rains coming through, especially along that big line later on tonight and uh, lightning will be a big threat coming through as well. So it's something that we need to pay attention to a uh, 70 forecast 91 for tomorrow around 90. Anyway, the chance for some lingering rain, probably not as stormy. And then after that rain chances are fairly low this week, but a pop up shower storm and temperatures in the upper 80s to near 90.